Welcome cruisers for another roundup of daily cruise news updates. Thank you for joining as we start procedures off with three stories, including Norwegian cruise ship helps kick off huge Alaska season for port. Godmother for new princess cruise ship announced and Scottish port begins busy cruise season. So join us as we delve fully into all these stories brought to you directly from cruisehive.com. Scotland's largest port in Aberdeen has launched its 2024 cruise season, anticipating a record-breaking year with 58 scheduled calls, including 22 maiden visits. The season commenced on April 8th with the arrival of Aida Sol from Hamburg in Germany, carrying nearly 2,000 guests. Guests were tendered ashore with a warm Scottish welcome, including music played on traditional Scottish bagpipes. Over the next few years, Aberdeen aims to host 100 cruise ship calls, attracting major companies like Holland America Line and Costa Cruises. With its scenic surroundings and diverse attractions, Aberdeen is solidifying its position as a premier cruise destination in the UK. British actress Hannah Waddingham will serve as godmother for the Sun Princess, the largest ever Princess Cruises ship. The official name in ceremony is set for April the 23rd in Barcelona. Waddingham, acclaimed for a role in the comedy series Ted Lasso, will christen the vessel during a 10-day round-trip sailing from Civitavecchia in Rome with stops including Gibraltar and Marseille. The Sun Princess, powered by liquefied natural gas, offers luxurious amenities and innovative dining experiences. After Mediterranean voyages, it will sail to Fort Lauderdale for Caribbean and Mexico cruises. Seattle kicked off its milestone Alaska season with the departure of Norwegian Bliss from the Port of Seattle on April 6th, marking the 25th year of cruises to Alaska from the city. The 168,000 gross ton ship offers seven night itineraries until October, with visits to scenic destinations like Sitka, Juno, and Glacier Bay. Over 275 sailings are planned from Seattle this year, with an estimated economic impact of nearly $900 million. Efforts towards environmental responsibility include advancing maritime decarbonization and implementing shore powers for all berths. And that's it for me today, cruisers. My name is Paul and all the news you require is over on cruisehive.com. Now, if anyone has any news, you can email us at newstips at cruisehive.com. Please show your support by liking our video and please subscribing to our channel. I hope you have a good day, cruisers, and I'll see you in the next video.